Hey guys, sorry it's been a little bit since I've posted. I've been a little busy. I went on vacation and and that's pretty much it. Today guys, we're gonna just wing it. We're gonna get right into it because I haven't posted in so long. Today we're gonna be looking at a TikToker named Jordan Flom with around 2.6 million followers. Ah, nice. I guess you could say this guy's like a family channel on TikTok. I wouldn't really know how to categorize him other than like <sighs> Facebook posts. <laughs> Almost all of his videos are formatted in a way where it's like the person recording is like just catching something crazy happening, just candidly catching some weirdo trying to fill up their car with vegetable oil. So much so that it's like, literally how would you possibly ever be so lucky as to see so many people doing so many outrageous things in public? So, you know, you, no matter who you are, eventually you gotta start questioning whether these are real or that's what you would expect. But this is TikTok, so of course, is 2.6 million followers and his comment sections look like this. This is incredible. That's a determined man there. Smart. <laughs> Brilliant. All respect. But yeah, when I say his posts are like Facebook posts, I mean that they're kind of catered towards like an older slash younger audience. The type of people who don't know when content is fake. So a lot of the videos, they just like wing it. They're just doing whatever, throw, throwing shit at the fan and seeing what sticks. And I'm not gonna lie, they perform really well. 99.9 .9 million million views, Bruh. 64 million views, Bruh. 26 million views, Bruh. Jesus f***ing Christ. A TikTok pays shit, but 99 million views, I've had a 20 million view video and they paid me like $500, so yeah, that's a lot of money. Anyways, I'm just gonna jump right into it because I'm kind of short on time today, so let's just go and find the first post that I ever saw from this channel. Right here, it's this, this bike dude. <laughs> Do you see that guy, Kim? He doesn't even have a seat, Kim. Do you see that guy, Kim? Do you see the guy that's three feet away from the car I just got into while I'm holding my camera up and recording it? Right off the bat, this is so obviously fake to anyone who has just a few brain cells. You know, like I said, this is this is Facebook content, so that's not the, the audience they're catering to. What is that? Do you see that thing? Plan it looks like a few planks of wood attached to a bike. Need any help or? <laughs> I love how he's like, dude, <laughs> what? You're recording me doing this in the middle of the, in the, in public? Oh my gosh. My favorite thing about these types of videos is you can always tell that they're just winging it. They're just like, okay, we're going to put some planks of wood on the back of a bike and you just pretend like we just found you. Okay, go. Your video went everywhere. Dude. I know. But I guess there's like a previous video, like a part one to this that I haven't seen, but who cares? It doesn't matter. Made this. Yeah, you want to see it? Okay. So you just take it, you pivot it back. Oh. And look, you just lock it right here. You're kidding. Yeah. No way. Okay, one more. And it just locks in. You're a genius. You are a genius. You are such a genius for attaching a, a few planks of wood to the back of your bike. And they've got hinges too. Next Einstein here. <laughs> Cam's here. What, what's your name? Cam. It's Cam. Cam. What's your name? So now I don't have to spend any money on scooters. And now you don't have to spend money on scooters. Great. Okay. Scooters get expensive. They can. It's it's like paying for an Uber, right? Like that. You don't want to go all the way to the tire. Yeah, of course, as we all know, you don't want to go all the way to the tire with the 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 wood plank, bike plank. That's just something you don't do. So like, what's up with the seat though? Because there's like. There's like no seat. Do you just sit on that or? So you gonna post this video too? I mean, we might have to, cause this is hilarious. <laughs> hey, this I mean, we don't mean to laugh. We're not trying to make fun. It's just oh, so, we're not fun it's just, it's just so fun. You gotta put this thing at the end to keep Whoa. it from falling what? off. Oh, a little, you got a little tab there. Thing. Yeah. Wow, that's pretty sturdy too. <laughs> that's pretty sturdy too. The whole thing is just wobbling already. I just can't get over how like, I just can't get over how pointless this is and how irrational it is to go out to a Publix and with a bike. He said earlier that buying, that having a scooter was like paying for an Uber. Just pay for a fucking Uber to drop your fucking groceries off. This is such a waste of time. This is so stupid. I think we have to officially be friends. I know, we might as well. So this. Yeah, that's what come I'm on. This goes right here. Okay. This is my seat. You're kidding. That's what I wow. said I am. You're gonna put your ass on the Coca-Cola? That's, 
Whoa, you're a genius, dude. Nobody wants your sweaty bike ass juices on their fucking Coke, on their Coca-Cola, dude. What the fuck? I just noticed in the description, it says caught on, hashtag caught on camera. Hashtag just naturally caught this guy on camera for, for the second time, apparently. <laughs> yeah, so you want to ratchet it right around. Uh huh? All the way through there. You are the naked MacGyver. <laughs> so you want to go nice and smoke. You post later. all your stuff on Facebook and I, everything? I love posting, yeah. We try to. Safety first. Be careful. All right, well, have a good one, man. See you later. See you later. And he's off. Look at him go. That's a genius for you. Now that's a, now that's a genius for you. <laughs> Forget rocket science. Forget nuclear fission. That's a genius. This guy with the bike with the plank of wood that's drooping down from the weight of his groceries on the back of his bike while he sits on a pack of Coca-Cola with his bare ass. <laughs> that's a genius right there. Do we gotta follow him? There is no way. He's got a lot more of these videos. Oh, okay, so here's part one of this video, uh, which I didn't see. And has 196.7 million views. Jesus. Jesus Christ, that is so many fucking views. And that's not even factoring in how many views they got on Instagram or Facebook or Snapchat. I'm sure this shit fucking blows up on Snapchat. <laughs> wow, isn't it just a crazy coincidence how he just happened to be in the same exact scenario as the other video? Like he's recording as he closes the door and the dude's just like not even an entire parking space away from him. And he's talking about him with his camera out. That's a crazy coincidence. That's a crazy caught on camera coincidence. There's Hashtag no caught way. on camera life hack. You actually think he's gonna do it? I don't know how to cost this, <laughs> but I'm There is no way he's getting all these groceries on that scooter, dude. Oh my gosh. What is he gonna do? How is he gonna do this? Okay, so what are those? Is that carabiners? Those are carabiners. She is like, this lady's like, there's no way. No, leave me. that lady out of, leave that lady out of the video. She's not involved. She's not part of your, your scripted fucking stupid caught on camera videos, man. Leave her alone. Kim, that's a, that's a safety vest and he's put zip ties on it. This is, Kim, he legit, he just put carabiners all over the back. Should we ask him if it needs help? Yeah. <laughs> Hey, you need any help? <laughs> hey, do you need any help? Hey, stranger, do you need any help? Or do you just want me to record you? Is it okay if I just record you? Good, yeah, man. I mean, you, you look like you've done it before, so. <laughs> yeah, every week. <laughs> Have a good one. Every week, Kim. Every week he does this. He's got a. He's legit got a watermelon. This is insufferable. So much of the so much of these videos are just empty space while they try to figure out what they want to say. Like for 30 seconds they just talk about this fucking watermelon and what he's going to do with this watermelon. He's got a he's legit got a watermelon. I just cannot wait to see what he does with this watermelon. And the watermelon's just sitting on the concrete on the ground outside. That's so fucking gross, dude. At least put your watermelon in a bag. <laughs> no. No. I just no the I'm just watching. I'm just, I just am impressed, dude. I'm impressed. You're filming right now? Yeah. You're filming right now? What? You're filming me right now with your phone in front of your face? <laughs> what? Oh my gosh. Oh. No normal person would just be like, you're filming me right now? <laughs> like, wouldn't you be embarrassed doing this? Wouldn't you be embarrassed being in public and doing this and inconveniencing people? You're taking up a whole parking space. There's not, there's, this is just such a waste of time. It's the same as the other video. It pisses me off so much. This isn't efficient. There's nothing efficient about this. I'm impressed. This is incredible. Hey, are you gonna put it on the internet? I uh, probably. <laughs> Dude, hey. do you actually do this? This is for real? Yeah. All right. If you don't have a car, it works well. I mean, yeah. Yeah, if you don't have a car, this works. Imagine he falls over. Imagine he hits a tiny little rock and he falls over and all, you, you know, the eggs and all the important stuff just slams all over his face and he's like, uh, he's crying. What are you going to do then? The car right here. Here, you can help me. What do you mean to do? Can you just put, put these on my back? Sometimes those oh. carabiners are hard to hit. Yeah, dude. Yeah, dude. Yeah, dude. Yeah, dude. For sure, dude. Ah, dude. 
see the carabiners? Yeah. No, I can't. I can't see the carabiners all over your body. Can't see the carabiners that you've already mentioned multiple times. On these rainy streets at that. You getting something? Kim, he's got a baby. A baby. What is that thing called? I don't have a baby. A baby what? carrier. A baby carrier. He's doing the watermelon with the baby carrier. I cannot believe you. <laughs> this is brain rotting content right here. So he's got the. He's got a baby, a baby. Why does this make me so angry? What about this content triggers primal rage inside of him? And he's off. And there he goes. So here's another good one uh, where he, you know, they're like, they just happen to catch somebody doing something wacky out in public. I have no Oh my God, he's got so many pizzas. What is he gonna do with all those pizzas? And he doesn't have a car? This guy's like, <laughs> there's no way. There's no way. So this time he's got a lot of pizzas. And if you can't tell, this is the same guy as the other, as the dude that was doing the groceries. So what a crazy coincidence that they just keep catching the same dude with these wacky encounters out in public. I think this is going to break the pizza record. This is going to be the record pizza right here. Oh. What is he? No. What? He's just going to distract. He's just going to strap these pizzas to his back and ride around. I mean, it looks good. <laughs> I assume he's having a party. He's got like 25 pizzas. I don't know how many that is. And then he's got half a backpack just stapled to a plank of wood. Wow, now now talk about genius. There is no way. There is no way. There is no way. Nobody ordered that many pizzas. No human could have a party large enough to ingest that much pizza. I'm gonna say it right now. Not even Great Gatsby could throw a party big enough to eat that many pizzas at once. Before this, this would break that record. This is so fucking stupid. Some kind of hook around. What's the deal? I don't know. We just came up. <laughs> so they've got like actual people in the background who are just you know like real people that are like, what the fuck is this fucking idiot doing right now? And then the people at the camera are like, beats me, beats me. I'm just recording. <laughs> I'm not a. I don't know what this guy's doing. I don't know this guy. I don't know this guy's name. And I don't know why he's got so many pizzas. <laughs> I'm just recording it. So he's got like a little, he's got one of those mechanical one wheeled skateboards. I don't know what those are, a little hoverboard. And he's gonna ride on that. I mean, I think it'll work. What is that? Is that a wheel? I have absolutely no problem. How is that any easier than just walking? Just walk. You hit one singular crack and you are going face first with 30 pounds of fucking pizza right smack your head into the concrete. Oh, is that what he's riding? Dude, he balance on that? I have no clue. So now we just gotta sit through 25 odd seconds of him awkwardly trying to stand up with all this pizza on his back. There's no way, there's not even pizzas in there. There's, I'm 100% sure there's no pizzas in there and those are just empty boxes, but it's gotta be hard to, hard to stand up with that and shit. Oh. Makes me feel bad that they have actual people like coming in and helping out. They've they've actually roped people with real lives into this shitty Facebook scenario that they made up. I would be so fucking pissed if I was going about my day and I wasted my time helping this dingleberry MacGyver together 25 pizza carrier. And then I am scrolling through TikTok later and I see myself looking like an idiot helping this guy. I would feel like such a fucking idiot. Hey, thank you, everyone. All right, see ya. <laughs> so four posts later, we get a continuation of this guy with the pizza on his back, except this time it's formatted like it's a whole new group of people that just happened to see this guy riding around with his pizzas and they got the footage and somehow they, they got the footage from those people and put it on 
their page. Like, I don't know. I don't know what their play is here. I don't know if they're trying to make it seem like s random people sent this footage in, or if, or if we're supposed to just somehow forget that this is all on the same page and it's all the same guy. But here we go. How many? <laughs> Wait. How many pizzas is that? Where is he going? Please follow him. Go fast. We have to see where he goes. Who ordered that many pizzas? Who could possibly order that many? Pizzas all at once. I love how they're just following him down the street in a car, like just slow. Like imagine being him in this scenario, as, as unlikely as this scenario is, you're trying as hard as you can to deliver these 30 pizzas without falling on your face. And there's just a car behind you, just 10 feet away, like right on your ass. I'd be so fucking annoyed. I'd be like, go around, go around. Do we know anybody over here that yeah. has this many people? Is he gonna make it up this hill? He looks lost. Also, what is that? Babe, what is that like? What is he on? It's just one of those one wheels. Like a skateboard? They follow him around for so long. It's been like an entire minute and he hasn't even gotten to the house yet. Okay, here we go. Is this that would that would feed that many people. Oh, it's a big rich house because big big rich house, big people, big they order big pizza, I'll order 30 pizza at the same time. <laughs> he falls off his scooter, he's trying to go up the hill, he's like... Almost he's ruined the entire video there. there has to be a party ruined here. it. Yes. <laughs> stack of pizzas is the size of the trees. Look. There's no way there's any pizza in those boxes. Look at the other cars are watching too. I need to see who's who's here. Who... The, you think it's oh, like a famous person? this is an person? agonizing watch. I hate, I hate this. Carrie Underwood ordering lots of pizza. <laughs> Endless stupid comments while we just watch this guy pretend that he's not carrying 30 empty pizza boxes on his back on a piece of wood. Look at the other cars are watching too. <laughs> the other cars are watching? Now you're holding other people? You're holding people up? Are they watching or they, can they just not go around you because you're parked in the middle of the fucking street? I'm about to find out. I need to see. You better get a good tip from this. Oh. Oh, it's a tiny little girl. That was a weird... It's a weird way to say that. <laughs> There's no way these aren't just like some they're, of their friends or like one, one of their friends' of kids or something. Cause nobody ordered this fucking pizza, man. I'm gonna go insane. Yeah, they said they're having a party. Yeah. I'm really pulling for this guy. I know. Selfie, pizza, pizza time. What else is there in this video? What else could there possibly be? Why are they trying to sell us on how great these inventions are? Like, they're just like, oh, he's such a genius. Look how, look how smart he is. Anyways, guys, that's going to be all for today. I'm sorry I haven't been posting much, but I will be posting more often. Hopefully doing uh, more of these unscripted videos sometimes as well. I want to say thank you to all of my patrons. Thank you guys. You guys are the best. If you do want to support me, head on over to patreon.com slash coopnoob20. It's only $2 a month for uh, the video a day early. So, and some other benefits. You get your name at the end of the video and whatnot. Anyways, guys, yeah, if you want a part two or anything like that, let me know. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe. Peace.